It is a miracle that this set exists in 2023. Uh, I got it actually around 1993 from Norman Lear, and it was just sort of slowly dying in storage in the San Fernando Valley. So the fact that not only the set walls live on, but everything on the set walls and the, and the floor coverings, it's just a miracle. I don't think it's ever been done before. I have to tell you about the first time I saw this set. They're stored sort of like dominoes, one by one by one by one to maximize storage space. And I was walking through with a client and out of the corner of my eye, I just saw, a, I don't know if it was even an inch of wallpaper. And I said, oh my God, that's the floral wallpaper from the bunker house. And uh, upon further investigation, I was correct. It was the living room set, the basic set as they would call it from all in the family. So keep in mind that when they put this wallpaper on the walls, it was already discontinued in 1970. It could have been 10 years old already. Well, that makes things difficult for a, a set decorator and an art director because if there's a problem, you can't buy 10 extra rolls and fix it. So with the wallpaper, what they would do is they would come in with paint brushes at the end of each season and hand paint in the little bits that got scraped off over the course of the year. Um, so that was rather magical. Um, all the set deck was sourced from thrift shops, the Goodwill in Santa Monica, California, and they wanted it to look like sort of a careworn home that probably hadn't been decorated since the 60s from Astoria, New York. And so a lot of thought went into making it look that shabby. Well, I had the good fortune of having worked for Norman Lear as a writer. So when I found the set, I had a direct line to him and I called and said, I'd like to meet with Mr. Lear. And he probably thought I was wanting to pitch him something. But, and I guess I was, but it wasn't a story. He had asked me, well, who, what other sets do you have? And I said, well, Mr. Carson gave me this Tonight Show set not that long ago. And he said, funny, I'm having lunch with Johnny on Friday. I'll ask him about it somewhere in a restaurant on Friday, Johnny Carson and Norman Lear are gonna be talking about me. That's a pretty good day for me. And so he said, you know what? If Johnny gave you his, it's done. Go, you can have it, good luck. And it was as simple as that. And then the hard work started. I feel fortunate that I got to curate and conserve this set, this piece of uh, social history for 30 years. And I believe that all important art sort of lives on, the art finds you, you have your shift or you have your segment of the race and then it gets passed on to the next person. So I hope it finds somebody with a big heart. I hope it finds somebody who understands not only on a intellectual level, but on a, on a personal level, how important these characters are, um, not just to us personally, but to our American culture.